Welcome to Austin, y'all, and to this exciting live stream about Power Over Ethernet from PoE Texas. If you have just one network cable and no way to add more, but you need to add more devices to your network, or maybe you're just ready to cut your cabling runs by up to 75% and your costs in half, then join me as I show you this. It's Tyler Andrews, head nerd here at PoE Texas, and I'm excited about the show because we're using PoE to cut down cabling infrastructure. Frankly, I've shown this guy to a few cable manufacturers I know, and they've practically thrown me out of their offices for making a product that can cut cabling cost runs to 75% and letting you pocket the savings. So let me show you how this works. First, how do we do this? How do we save 75% cable run. Well, we took a normal PoE switch, we squeezed it down, made it a little bit more rugged, made it PoE powered, and put it into a stylish case you can mount into a single gang wall box or low voltage ring. That's how we got to the GBT4IW. You can simply plug it into a PoE source for power and data, mount it, and start using it. No complicated configurations, no command line protocols, simple. Where would you use this? Well, we've all been there before. You have several IP phones, IP cameras, Wi-Fi access points, or any kind of network device, and you've only got one network drop. You've checked and there's no way you're getting another network cable to where you need it. Take a hotel room, for example. You can never get any more cables in those walls but you need more ports. Take advantage of your Power Over Ethernet network to add multiple ports right where you need them. The GBT4IW delivers four ports for the price of one cable. Case two, networking best practices say to put four network drops at every wall plate. And you know what, that makes sense. Even if you think you need one network drop, you'll end up needing four. But those cables come with a price tag that adds up. Whether you're installing a call center with white phones, an office campus, or hotel rooms, cut your cable infrastructure by up to 75% and put the savings back in your pocket. What do you need to use the GBT for IW? Let me show you a quick video. The only thing you have to have available on your network to install the GBT for IW is Power Over Ethernet or PoE. Don't know what PoE is? Check out our video here. Don't have PoE? No problem. PoE Texas has a Texas sized line of PoE products to fit almost any network and any budget. Check them out here. The GBT4IW works with any type of PoE from traditional 802.3 AF PoE and PoE Plus all the way up to the new high powered PoE. The type of PoE you have will determine what power budget you have available on your GBT4IW. To get the most out of your GBT4IW, you can take advantage of the new IEEE 802.3BT Type 4 PoE to get up to 60 watts of PoE power on this device. Now, how do you install it? Let me show you another video. GBT4IW installs into any single gang switch box or low voltage mounting ring. All you need is one network cable into the box or to the ring. First, remove the cover plate. Second, plug in the network cable with PoE into the back of the device. Check that you have power with the blue LED light. Then mount the GBT4IW like you would any switch or wall device. Finally, press on the cover plate. Et voila, you're ready to go. There's no configuration required. The GBT4IW acts like a network switch. It will get IP addresses automatically from your main router or switch. There's nothing left to do but plug in your device. Well, there is one more thing to think about to get the very most out of your GBT4IW, your power budget. 
Remember I flashed the power information up on the screen earlier? Let's go back to that for a second. As I told you, the GBT4IW can take power from any PoE switch. So if you have a regular PoE switch, your GBT4IW will have a 10 watt budget. That means you can power something like an IP phone using PoE and connect three other network devices, whether they're a computer, Wi-Fi access point, or point of sale station. If you have PoE Plus, your GBT4IW will have a 22 watt budget. That means you can plug in three, maybe four IP phones and a computer, or you can add one GAT USB-C PD to send power and data to your iPad Pro Gen 3 or Surface Go. However, to get the very most out of your GBT4IW, you can connect it to IEEE 802.3 BT Type 4 PoE and have a full 60 watt PoE budget. That's two PoE Plus devices or four full capacity PoE devices. For example, you could use four of our PoE to iPad adapters all in one cable. So, thanks for coming. What questions do you all have? Put your questions and comments in the comments section below. You can check out the GBT4IW on Amazon or our website, www.poetexas.com. Give it a shot. Give us your feedback. Tell us what you think about it. We want to help you maximize or optimize your PoE network by choosing the GBT4IW when you need multiple network drops. If you find this show interesting or helpful, please share it with your friends, colleagues, and even customers. Hit that like button. Hit the subscribe button. You might be shocked to find out that sharing these channels and watching them on your social channels will increase your reputation as an expert and increase your business. We'll be back in February to launch another new product that will deliver IEEE 802.3BT power. Cost effectively deliver 75 watts of power to your PoE lighting, PoE computers, or PoE displays. So don't miss it. We'll see you at the next live show. Thanks for coming.